I am Dr. Sureka Tiwari. I am a homeopathic physician and a psychological counselor. I have been in Bangalore for the last 17 years. I have two clinics, one in ACS layout and one in HSR layout. I have been practicing out of these clinics with good results and very, very happy patients. Veins are vessels which carry impure blood back to the heart. They do not have any pulsations because they are not related to the heartbeat and they have valves to stop flow through them. But veins are very good manifestation ground if there are any clotting mechanism happening in the body which is, should not be there. In that case, wherever there will be a thrombus which is literally translated into layman term, a clot which occludes or obstructs the flow through a vein, then the vein will start having a blood column which will start having some kind of a pulsatile impulse. If you have it in the elbow, you can safely assume that there is a clot somewhere around the elbow, either in the subclavicular artery or in your arm. A Doppler will tell you where the obstruction is and there is solution available for it. Those solutions in homeopathy typically break down the clot. In the first 72 hours, even an injection helps to make sure that the clot dissolves and the pulsatile can be done with. Now, dyslexia is a learning disability. Dyslexia has nothing to do with your arm use. Dyslexia and pulsatile venous flow are not, not connected in any form.